Spacey walked in, a slight smile on his face. He didn't answer any of the questions that reporters shouted at him as he walked in. Didn't say much inside either. Welcome to Watch Mojo. And today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 biggest Hollywood cover-ups. It wasn't until I was 31 that I finally did ask my mother and did hear the truth from her. But by that time, my father had died. For this list, we'll be ranking the strangest mysteries and most troubling scandals to ever be covered up by Tinseltown. Can you think of any Hollywood cover-ups we missed? Let us know in the comments. Number 10, Alfred Hitchcock's Obsessions. Do consumers of art possess a mandate to separate that art from the artist? It's a difficult question without a clear answer. Such a case can be made for the films of Alfred Hitchcock, an undeniably brilliant practitioner of the medium with a troubled personal history. Well, something like that. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't mean to sound so mysterious. Specifically, Hitchcock rallied behind the scenes against actress Tippi Hedren after the latter allegedly refused his sexual advances. The director reportedly worked to actively sabotage Hendren's career after the pair's turbulent relationship filming The Birds, a story that was dramatized in the 2012 film The Girl. <laughs> Elsewhere, Hendren's granddaughter, Dakota Johnson, mentioned how Hitchcock wasn't held accountable during a 2021 appearance on the Awards Chatter podcast. You know, Hitchcock ruined her career because she didn't want to sleep with him, and he terrorized her. Number 9. Loretta Young Adopted Her Own Child It only works when you deserve to have what you take. Otherwise, it's stealing. The world of Golden Age Hollywood may have glittered on the outside, but this light was not cast without some deep shadows. Specifically, unplanned pregnancies were often fixed by film studios, either through hush-hush abortions or abandonment. Loretta Young gave birth to a daughter, Judy, via an affair with Clark Gable. Uh, do you resent the fact that I went to Harvard? Do you resent the fact that I didn't? Oh, no, no, I admire you, Steve. I admire your two-fisted way of doing things. We make a good team, brains and brawn. Right. Judy's origins were hidden from the public and the press, with the little girl being placed in orphanages. Young would later adopt her own daughter in an effort to distance the pregnancy from both her own career and Gables. And at 19 months old, my mother announced to the world that she had adopted me, but it was all a smokescreen and it fooled nobody. In later years, Young's daughter-in-law, Linda Lewis, asserted that the former had confided in her that the affair was actually non-consensual, although this has not been proven. Number eight, Britney Spears' conservatorship. No the subject of the Britney Spears conservatorship is a difficult one to discuss in such a short time, but it's certainly a look into the struggles some face within the public eye. Spears achieved worldwide fame at an extremely young and vulnerable age, an age where not everyone is emotionally equipped to deal with what might potentially come their way. I just want to be a happy person. That's really important just to spread joy, you know, and be a happy person. Spears' breakdown in the 2000s was followed by a stay at the Ronald Reagan UCLA Medical Center, after which her financial assets were placed in a conservatorship. This conservatorship was governed by her father and an attorney. Yet it wasn't until recent years that Spears' fight to escape this conservatorship has come to light, specifically with the hashtag and movement, hashtag Free Britney. She deserves all of the freedom. We're, doing, we're, we're feeling great. so excited. As long as Britney's happy, we're happy. Number seven. Rock Hudson's sexuality. I'm an inspector. What would you like to inspect? You. It wasn't always easy for LGBTQ plus celebrities to come out into the spotlight. This was doubly true in old school Hollywood, and it wasn't out of place for gay actors and actresses to enjoy full careers portraying characters in straight relationships. Rock Hudson was once such actor, even going as far as to play Lotharios in films such as 1971's Pretty Maids All in a Row. Hello, you live around here? I offer you a drink. I live right there. Rock Hudson's life as a gay man was a well-kept secret in Hollywood. However, stories about this life were often held over his head as a threat by those in the media, such as Confidential Magazine, which desired some high-profile headlines. Hudson's HIV diagnosis in the 1980s was also kept secret, and the actor succumbed to complications in 1985. Rock Hudson, aware of his disease, went to Paris for treatment to the Louis Pasteur Institute. Number six, Errol Flynn's predatory behavior. I've been admiring some of the jewels we found in your chest, particularly the wrought gold. It's Aztec, isn't it?
The archetype of the prototypical Hollywood bad boy could potentially be traced back to Errol Flynn. This was an actor to whom drugs, women, and drinks were no stranger. However, we can also add controversy to this list, thanks to Flynn's alleged involvement with underage girls. Examples of this can be traced back to one of Flynn's co-stars, Beverly Adland, whose mother asserted that Flynn forced himself on her daughter. Was there ever a point that you ever felt he was forcing himself on you? Yes, I did, the first, the first night. Um, and I tried, truthfully, to uh, not have any contact with him. It was further alleged that the Adventures of Robin Hood star was a voyeur and had two-way mirrors installed in his mansion, including the bathrooms. Yikes. I'm only just beginning. From this night on, I use every means in my power to fight you. Number five, the Kevin Spacey scandal. Well, it was very nice meeting you, Angela. Any friend of Janie's is a friend of mine. In October 2022, Kevin Spacey was found not guilty of abusing actor Anthony Rapp. However, Spacey still faces sexual assault charges in a separate series of lawsuits at the time of this writing. This begs the question, how much did Hollywood know about these controversies behind the scenes? Lots of media and public interest at London Courthouse today as this man, Kevin Spacey, appeared. A 2017 article from the New York Post insinuated that some in Tinseltown circles were allegedly aware of harassing behavior on the part of Spacey. Around the same time, Spacey came out as gay, with many feeling he was trying to shift attention away from his scandal. Still, questions remain about just how much, if any, of Spacey's conduct was inappropriate. I didn't lose it. It's not like, whoops, where'd my job go? I quit! Someone passed the asparagus. Oh, oh. Number four, Judy Garland's incentivized substance use disorder. We must be over the rainbow. The old school Hollywood system possessed an amount of control that didn't stop at the then standard and binding contracts. Oftentimes, executives at film studios would ply their stars with narcotics in order to achieve the best return on their investments. Time is money, and stars like Judy Garland would often be forced to work long hours without a break. Cut. That's it. Very good, everybody. Very good. Fine, Becky. Fine. Look, you take it easy for a bit. We've got to move in for the closer angle, okay? okay? In order to facilitate this laborious practice, uppers would be given to pep up Garland. This also served a double purpose in keeping the actress's weight down for the silver screen. Then, it was sleeping pills to shut Garland down, only for the cycle to return the next day. Unfortunately, not enough attention was paid to the substance use disorder that Garland would develop as a result of this practice, culminating in her death at the age of 47 in 1969. I, I don't think that I'll be here again. And I didn't do so well at my last show. Number three, Jeffrey Epstein. You know, the excuse was, well, it's a business story. It was a business story, but just like life, the story was more complicated, far more complicated. The life of Jeffrey Epstein is notorious for a number of reasons, including his laundry list of questionable activities within the financial sector. More high profile and disturbing, however, was Epstein's involvement in the sex trade, specifically with the trafficking of girls to high profile clients. The get together more than a decade before Epstein pleaded guilty to prostitution charges in Florida. Both men are seen enjoying themselves. It was the profiles of these alleged clients that served as the crux of the Epstein cover-up. This was in addition to Epstein's non-prosecution agreement for sex crimes committed between 2005 and 2006, as well as the state of New York's failure to check in with Epstein as a registered level three sex offender. Names of those said to have been involved with Epstein include the Duke of York, Prince Andrew. And Gillen said he's coming back to the house. And I want you to do for him what you do for Epstein. Number two, the Bill Cosby scandal. I'm telling you where the road is out. Now, you want to go here or you want to be concerned about who's giving you the message? Remember what we mentioned earlier about separating the art from the artist? This question comes up once again with regard to Bill Cosby, once thought to be one of the world's most beloved actors and comedians. The Emmy Award winner was once seen as America's dad, but all of that came crashing down after allegations of misconduct surfaced in the media. It was alleged that Cosby possessed a long history of inappropriate conduct and behavior, assertions of which never seemed to stick to Cosby's well-cultivated public image. You guys will come to the funeral? Yes! yes. <laughs> You'll do whatever I ask you to? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Bill Cosby would be found guilty in 2018, although this conviction would later be overturned in 2021. But I'm very happy okay. to know that Mr. Cosby will do time in prison, that he is touchable like he touched us. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. 
If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Harvey Weinstein's Misconduct The Me Too movement brought to light a lot of predatory and unacceptable behavior against women in the entertainment industry. There has to be a comeuppance for all of this, all of the people who are part of that chain. And then we have to make it safe for people to feel that they can talk about this. And in doing that, I think that'll scare away that kind of behavior. Film producer and Miramax co-founder Harvey Weinstein was one of the most high-profile targets taken down in the wake of Me Too's rise, exposing a career's worth of allegations. Weinstein reportedly went to great lengths to avoid news of such allegations reaching the media. In the following weeks, dozens more women, some famous, some not, would come forward. These included the reported hiring of intelligence agents compiling character assassination dossiers on the accusers, to allegedly asking Hillary Clinton to intervene on his behalf. Weinstein was unsuccessful and was convicted on two charges in February 2020. That investigation revealed that this defendant used his position, money, and power to lure young women into situations where he was able to violate them sexually. Check out these other clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.